this is the wonders of modern technology, mate. <laughs> I tried to get a t-shirt done, and, <laughs> and he's doing it himself. Typical farmer. Okay. Here goes. We want uh, 90 seconds. Hey, stunner. It's yeah. nice and warm, too. <laughs> How long did that take you to do? Uh, about five minutes. Brilliant. And it cost about five pounds to do as well. This is the future of farming. I can't find my meal either. There we are. Yeah, I don't think I've got it. My name is Lord. Loading. Meal reader. I keep around that Where's the press button? The, uh... It'll, as soon as it gets it, it'll click. Um, and all I've got is this application called Neo Reader, yep. but most of them come with one. And then as soon as it sees one of these codes, it links you straight into her website. Uh, <laughs> there she is. There she is. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, it's do it for ourselves. Mm -hmm. uh, and so that people can actually see it on the shelf and think, okay, I'll watch that and I'll meet the person who's making it. So it gives us a really, it gives us a big competitive <coughs> advantage. Mm -hmm. Stuart's in here today, and he's uh, he won't be here for long. He's going to meet our um, nutritionist because we're working out Kai's diet now for um, you know to make sure that the milk's going to keep on keep on well through the summer, and uh, hopefully it'll be good for the cheese. Um, no, it's fun. Thank you. Which, which is it, Stu? Is it a Wednesday mm. or a Cheddar? Wednesday. Um, so I'm introducing yourself. I'm Ian. Hi, I'm Ian from the Shropshire Cheese Company. What's your surname? S. A Y R E S. No, the name. Uh, like Jane, yeah, but with an S. Right. Sure. Uh, so describe where we are now. Uh, well, we're just in the the Abertan Farm Dairy, where we make our cheese on the farm. Um, as you can see in the corner, we've got the we've got the pipes where the milk comes direct from the milking parlour across the, across the yard. So the milk actually comes about 100 yards under the ground? That's right, yeah. You can't get much closer than that. No, no, that's great. Right. <laughs> As confidence goes, that's quite good. And um, it, it saves us a lot of washing up. It's actually pasteurised, so it lands in our back there in the corner, where we, um, where we can work with it. How much will that take? Then? That's well, that'd that'd a small take, so That'll actually take 5,000 litres. But um, we take a smaller amount than that so that we can give it a bit more attention. And then once it's in the stage of being curved and weighed and it's been cut properly, uh, we put it in that solid tank where we can work with it by hand then. Um, because the later stages of cheese making are quite hands on. So we like it low down very committed. So it's an award winning cheese. What kind of cheese is it? Uh, we've got several, but our latest one we've launched is a Shropshire Blue. Uh, which won the Heart of England Fine Foods Uh We'll be piercing each of those about 100 times each. What for? Uh, that lets the air into the cheese, so that the blue mould that's present can Put get active. Well, it's already in there, it just needs oxygen to get active and turn blue. Um, so piercing allows, gives us that nice blue veining all the way through. Stay with us a little later in the show, we'll find out how the latest high-tech developments I mean, this could be being sold all over the world. Hopefully. Hopefully. Could <laughs> you just explain what you're doing? Oh, you know, I'm on video side. So yeah, yeah. No, I was, <laughs> I've, uh, we're in the cheese store at the moment. I've just called one of our um, large uh, marches blue that uh, Ian's been just bantering about. And uh, it's got lovely veining, as you see. It's about uh, 12 weeks old, and we're just about to taste some. So I hope you're very jealous. Mm. Yeah, what do you think? Thank you. So all, all you do is take your phone, and uh, if you've got a barcode reading app, mine's called Neo Reader. Okay. Uh, all you do is open that app, and it uses the camera. And as soon as the camera spots the code, which will be on your label or on the shelf, yeah, links you straight into whatever you want. So I've set this one to take you to our Twitter page. Okay. So anybody sitting in the shop, standing in the shop. Sees yeah. our product, yeah. and then sees our Twitter page, sees a video of me going on like, hello, you know. Um, it's brilliant. It's a, a way of getting to see your customers. Yeah. Well, I mean, the big companies, they can, they can have an advert that explains why a product's so good. But right, uh, right. we can't afford that, but we can do this, which is much cleverer. And be like, hi, I'm Ian, I'm making the cheese today, and they can see that in the shop. 
So the cows in front, they're all uh, pregnant. They're about to calve in the next sort of month. Uh, the one on the left, she's really ready. So, uh... Ah, uh, oh, it's cold and wet. Ah! Hello. Hello. Oh, damn it. Okay, I'm cold and wet, Dad. <laughs> the cows have all disappeared, but anyway, please get our farmers on film for the Olympics.